nice to see you back here on my channel um today i want to do some muffins and because i'm not a very good baker i have bought a muffin mix so that i can do muffins with some flavor of uh, citron and yes we will do it together but first of all i hope you, hope you see or you can remember the dress i wear today because this one was one of the uh, unpacking from one of my last videos okay not bad Nice to see you back here on my channel. Today I want to do some nice muffins and because I'm not a very good baker I bought a muffin mix so it's much easier for me to do uh, the muffins with you together. Uh, but first of all I hope you remember my one of my last videos uh, with this unpacking of all of my dresses or the new dresses. Today I wear one of this dress. I hope you like it when I wear it. But I it's a little bit warm in here, so I have to open my sleeves and make it a little bit more like this here. And I hope you also like my pantyhouse. house. This is a nice brown one with black dots and um, yes, I think it will match very well together with the dress and of course with my nice shoes. So, but before I can start, I have forgotten the bowl. Give me a second. my bowl and now let's see what we do or what we can do okay this one and that one okay this is a normal mix and this is a topping so can I need first of all this one here but I need some more stuff to do in. Okay, I need some oil, some milk, and two middle eggs. But first of all, before I start with the mixing and so on, I have to preheat the oven. Let's let me check to which temperature. Uh, okay, yes. So just preheat. So then I put it later in. But the oven will be nice and warm, so everything will be fine. Okay, then we can start with the mixing. 
First of all, I have to put them here. The toes is around about 12. So let me see if I can really do 12 ones. Eleven and number twelve. Now I have this one. So now I have to put this one in the bow. I need two eggs, so put in the fridge and take my two eggs. But I first of all I do them here because I also need a mixer. And this stuff here. I need some oil and what else oh also milk and milk here we are but i also need something to measure this stuff okay give me a second i have to pick it up because there is a small scaler. Uh, it was 125 milliliters of these ones. So let me see. Oh, I think it's a lot of them. Well, I can take two, 125. I will do 125. So the middle between 100 and 150. Perfect. So let me read. Okay, mix in the bowl. Let's write. Then the oil, then the milk, and the eggs. So just put the oil in. Oh yes, and I can use the same one for 75 milliliters of milk. So 50 and um, 75, yes, and also Because this I didn't need any longer, I can open the eggs. And put this one in here. And the second one. Now I have to mix it carefully. So, this one here. No. Oh, yes. This is right. Because I have to be careful if they have different ends. So I must put the right end in the right. This is here, 
and with this air. And now mixing time. And you, as you see, it's a nice and smooth. So, oops, I can do it in the forms. But first, I think I have to relax a little bit with one here so that I can peel it off so that I don't lose. So much of this one. Okay, just let me screw the eggs away. Check the oven, how hot it is. Yes, I think it will be nice and fine. Okay, and now I need two small spoons to put it in the forms. Uh, first, I have to clean a little bit of the mess here. And now, just a little bit more light, and then I can do it in here, or maybe I'll put them here, so you can see it much better, and so you must not see my back during I do this, so it's much better. Start first with one small spoon. No, it's not so good. I take the rest of the first ones. So it's better, so you can see it more.
sometimes when I have not flavored um, muffins, just only normal vanilla flavor or so, I do between the first spoon and the second spoon a piece of jam and um, maybe some strawberries jam or so and so that you have another taste in the muffins. Um, it's a little bit surprising then for the people who eat the muffins, it's not just a normal one with a normal vanilla flavor or so, but when they have a bit of them, that there's also some strawberry flavor or whatever, maybe some mango or cherry and so on. much in so I have to put some more in. Everything is here, and now I have to put the muffins in the oven, which is well preheated, and then it must be in there for around about 20 minutes. But uh, after I've done them in the oven, I will do a shortcut uh, from the video. So that you have not, or that I do here around about 20 minutes, something like that. So now on the middle of the oven, in. during the next 20 minutes, I will often check how the muffins look like so that they don't get too dark and everything will. Find them, and after I pick them up out of the oven, I will do the topping. It's a citrus flavored uh, uh, topping. So, and how I do this, I will show you then. Okay, see you back in some minutes. last 20 minutes I have checked the all time or around about after the first 10 minutes the muffins and then five minutes before and now I think it will be the last check so let me see oh it's warm oh yes 
Yes, they look very, very good. Yes, they are perfect. So, let's switch the oven off. Uh, oh, it smells so delicious. Unfortunately, there's no video with smell, so that you can smell them. It's so delicious. And now, put them out. Ooh, hot, 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 hot. Yes, so now I have 12 nice muffins. Um, but uh, I have to cool them down a little bit before I do the topping on and but during they will cool off I can prepare the topping but for this I need a small bowl I will pick it up so a nice small glass bowl and now the topping mixture mixes in. Just how can I open it? So yes, that will be fine. I need two big spoons of hot water. So I do some hot water in a glass and then I can do it much better and mix the topping. So I have to give the water some time to heat up. Um, and then I have to put the muffins over here on this side so that you can see much better how I do the topping on. But I think it will be a little bit too much of the topping, but let's see. So maybe I do a little bit thicker uh, topping on. And now I don't want to have forgotten. I want to buy some nice uh, candies to use them over the, uh, the topping. So that I have some colored sprinkles on. So let me check the water. Yes, it is hot. And now I have to put two big spoons. One and two in the topping mixture. You can see what you can see it like this here. All the mixture got from powder liquid. I have to mix it very well. I don't do anything of mess because then after this I have to clean the kitchen again but I don't want to do this so I'm just a little bit careful during our mixes that everything will be good and no drops are falling down because they are a little bit sticky and Be fine like this. Good. Uh, 
Out of the way, out of the way. easier with a small spoon to put the topping on. See? I see the little margins like that. Hold them with the hand. Don't put the topping on. Mmm, looks delicious. And a little bit more topping here. And it's just dripping a little bit on the side down. That will be not bad because I think this, this looks very individual for each muffin because they are homemade and not used for, to be perfect, just done with love to taste delicious. So number three and number four. One of the muffins has come out of the form and good. Mm. Oh yeah. Mm. Delicious. Mm. <laughs> Looks like this here. But you I don't put it away, I just leave it. Number six. Six more to go. Also like this one here. This is homemade. And then I, I think then I, they are allowed to look a little big. Like this one here. Also another one like this. Spoon away and then I get everything off the topping. And number six, no, number nine, sorry. Now 
the last one. very well because no chopping is left it's not too much on them but not and also not too less so <gasps> oops uh, and now they can cool down and after this it's very cool and then I can have a cup of coffee with one or two of the muffins. Mmm, yes. Very delicious, also the topping. So, hope you like, like my baking and uh, you like my channel. So, if so, please subscribe it and see what I do soon on my channel also with my treat mile or outdoor indoor with some new shoes with stockings with fancy house with new dresses and so on so yeah see you soon again on my channel bye bye